Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we have trouble on the track. Oh, they uh, just crashed. Oh, he's flipping. Oh, no, don't hit me. Don't hit me. Oh. Hello, YouTube Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of RevHead. First off, I want to apologize for how long it's been since the last episode. As many of you know about my power situation last week, and it was really, really hard to make videos. So we are back here today, and I've already spotted something that I am about to do. So we have our nice little muscle car here. It's got a GTO V8 in it. But I spotted a motor in the newspaper that I want to buy. So there is a racing motor down here. It's a new V8 engine. It is the XGTV8. I'm thinking this is going to be worth it. This thing is in new shape. It's been modified for racing. And it's $13,000. Now, the money isn't so much of a concern for me. So we're going to go ahead and take that. And I believe we are going to do a little bit of an engine swap here. And we're probably going to repaint this bad boy and go racing. Because we have a new track that we are going to get to go to here today. So let's go ahead and put this up on the lift. And let's remove our motor. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do with this motor. Uh, let's go ahead and take the uh, supercharger off real quick. And then we're going to move in and just completely remove the motor here. And let's do that. And we're going to put in a new motor. So we've got this XG TV8. How many horsepower was this? I believe it was right around 400 or maybe it was 362. Uh, let's throw in this new one real quick. And oh boy, it's going to need some parts in it. Uh, we should have most of these parts, but this is going to be good. So, you know, we really probably could rip out the other parts out of the other motor real quick. And then we can uh, install most of them in here and then we'll see what additional parts we'll have to get. Uh, looks like we need carburetor, oil filter, starter. I've got most of this stuff. Uh, the carburetor, I'm not sure, but I think I saw one in the newspaper for this motor. This is like the, is it Yora or Aurora 2? <laughs> Gotta learn how to pronounce things, right? Uh, 591 horsepower, so this thing's a bit of a beast. So let's go ahead and go into the newspaper real quick. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and buy the uh, the carburetor here, 850, not too bad. Uh, what else? I guess, let's go ahead and just grab a couple of things here, even though I'm pretty sure I have quite a few of these parts. I just gotta make sure that I've got what I want here. So, thinking that's good. So we'll do that. Let's go ahead and install the carburetor for it. There it is. Install that bad boy. What else we have? Oil filter, yep, got a new one of those to install. Uh, let's see. Starter, I don't have a starter on me, but I'm pretty sure I've got one on that other motor. We're probably gonna, I, I don't know, I'm debating. Do I wanna strip that other motor? I think we're going to, and we might just hold it to the side because I'm gonna need some of the parts off of it because I don't think that the, uh, I don't think that the paper has all the parts that I need right now. So that's a, uh, that's a bit of a concern, but I'm gonna go through the rest of these. Yep, I've got quite a few of these actually. There's a water pump. Uh, do we have spark plugs? No, I don't. How do I not have spark plugs? Seems like I rip out a ton of parts out of these motors, but I don't have some of this, so... What about ignition system? Yes, we do. It's a Narnu. Can I stick that on there? I think it's for a V8, so that's good to go there. Okay, so what we're lacking on the motor here... Oh, that's a horn. Uh, the motor is lacking a starter, generator, and spark plugs. So I'm pretty sure I can go find most of that. Let's go back to the paper and we'll check it out. All right, so we're just picking up a variety of parts here. We've got quite a bit of what I need. Uh, there might be a couple things I'm gonna be missing. Uh, there's just a lot of browsing that I'm having to do here. I might as well look, uh, is there anything extremely cheap we can get into? I'm really digging that uh, Magura Drag Racer there, but that's 40,000 bucks that I don't have right now. So let's uh, pick back into this engine real quick. I think I was able to find, I wasn't able to find the spark plugs yet. We'll probably have to get those off something else. Uh, I think I have the starter here. So let's go ahead and install that. So we did a complete engine swap here. The generator, I still don't think I have. That's the only thing I'm really lacking. I think we're going to stick the uh, supercharger on this one too. And we're going to repaint it. But yeah, it's finding the, uh, the spark plugs. You know, Am I going to be that cheap? I could just go out in the lot and rip the spark plugs off another vehicle here. You know, we've got two Narnus setting here. Uh, let's throw this one in the shop real quick. And this feels really cheap doing, but I kind of need uh, some parts here. 
and the paper is not providing all the parts that I need. So, guess we can take the generator off this one. Let's go ahead and fix it and remove it. Hopefully it's going to be the right type. And then we're going to take the spark plugs. They're generic, so they should fit on there. So, sorry about that car, but necessary things are going to happen here. So, let's go ahead and go back out into the parking lot, and let's swap back into this. Now, I want to paint this thing again. I like the black with the skunk stripes, but it feels like we've got a new motor, we've got a new car here. So, we're going to do a bit of work there. Let's go ahead and install the last couple engine parts that I need in here. Let's see, right here. So, there's a generator. There we go. Install, and spark plugs. There we go. Good to go there. I could, let's see, let's go ahead and remove, actually, do, do we need an air filter? I need a racing air filter. Actually, whoa, 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 never mind. Supercharger. Hmm, midsize, midsize sounds pretty good. Let's go ahead and install that in. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, uh, where do we get the number plates from? I don't think I've seen those. Are those in the paper? I could have missed them, but I don't know, I'm not really sure. Let's go and put this thing on the ground. Uh, she's almost ready to go. She did receive a little bit of damage last episode. Uh, we had a, a couple boo-boos, but it wasn't too bad. So let's go ahead and check, make sure there's nothing that needs to be repaired. Batteries, almost good. Tire pressures, add a little there. And what about oil? How are we doing there? Seems like, you know, let's go ahead and just change it. Make sure we get that race oil in there. There we go. Good to go there. And let's go into paint. So paint wise, Hmm, I'm thinking we're gonna go, oh, that actually, that's actually pretty. I like that. I like skunk stripes, that's just an, it's like an obsession of mine. So I think if we do that, and maybe if we do, let's say blue skunk stripes. Oh yes, that is beautiful. That is absolutely gorgeous. So we're gonna go with that, 250 there. And I think we're ready to go racing. Uh, we gotta earn some of this money back. The motor was expensive, so. They supposedly added, you know, we might need to stop by a gas station on the way there. Uh, we're going to go down to, is that Gouda? Gouda? Gouda Raceway Park? It sounds like, isn't, I think that's a cheese, isn't it? I don't know, I've just confused myself. So we've got that, and I think we need to go discover this over here. This is a force. This is a new track that they just recently updated. So let's go out to Raceway Park. I think this is an oval track, which is going to be really pretty cool. Uh, so we're going to do that. Let's go ahead. Can I... Can I quick travel to the gas station here? No, I can't, so we gotta go straight to the park. So I guess the first thing to do is to go ahead and try a time trial here. Good day, mate. Feeling like leaving a bit of a wager? Well, I feel like we have a racing motor. I feel like we're gonna be fast. I don't know about tire-wise. They've done some updates to that. Uh, hopefully our tires are good. Um, Let's go ahead. We're gonna be... Uh, we're gonna go with the bronze. We're gonna play it safe. And then we can risk a little bit more during the race. I just want to make sure that we're okay here. So, 1,500. Yeah, let's do that. All right. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Might need to put it into <laughs> first there. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at the, how far the back end kicks down under acceleration. Oh, this is an oval. So, we basically have a, an Australian NASCAR track. Okay. Uh, I can deal with this. You know what? I like to play NASCAR games, so maybe I can... I can handle this. Uh, car does feel pretty good. Feels like we're lacking a little bit of grip with the tires. Now, I don't know how much of that is to do with the update itself. I'm going to have to be careful. I need to probably find some new tires here. So let's go ahead. Going to be very, very careful this first lap. I feel like we're actually going to breeze through it. I'm kind of curious. Can I grab another gear here? Let's go down a gear. Yeah, you know what? It does feel like I could probably grab a gear. So let's go ahead and start our second lap here. This is pretty cool. I didn't know they had an oval here, so curious as to how the race is going to happen. Now, that's another update that they've done. Is supposedly the AI actually runs different setups now, so hopefully they're a little bit more competitive on the different tracks because I have been absolutely smoking the AI. So that's one thing that's been a little bit disappointing, but yeah, we're doing pretty good here. So we're in fourth gear. You know, I feel like maybe we can grab fifth, but fourth feels pretty good right now. Feels like it gives us that pickup that we can uh, get off the corner. So, yeah, I'm definitely glad we chose. Oh, it's a little bit of wall damage. I'm really glad we chose the. Uh, well, actually, not that was close. Wow, we were one tenth or maybe two tenths off the uh, silver time, but it doesn't matter since we've only wagered uh, the bronze. 
So, oh, that was kind of a bad turn there. But overall, pretty happy with this car. I feel like it would be nice to have a bit more grip. And it looks like we have a bit of damage on our right side. Did I notice that? Uh, it's probably just some cosmetic uh, damage. Probably okay. Uh, but yeah, I would like to have a little bit more grip in the tires. So we might have to see if we can find some sort of high grip, maybe racing tires if they have them. Uh, that's about the only thing that I can see changing with this car. So here we go. We're going to complete this lap and time trial is over. Came close there. We've got bronze. That's what we uh, betted on. But yeah, I'm actually glad we did that. If we would have bet it silver, we wouldn't have gotten it. So that's not bad. So the races, I kind of want to have to go back into because I want to get to the race, but I have to do another time trial because I think I have to achieve silver in order to do that. Alright, so we're doing a bit of repairs. One thing I complained about during the race there, our tires weren't gripping. So we're going to go with slicks. Now don't let that name deceive you. Slicks in theory are like racing slicks. They've got a lot of grip to them while they're good. I'm hoping that's going to work. So we've got a set of slicks. They're going to fit on here so I'm hoping that this is going to help us get some grip because that is something we are desperately needing right now on that track and I think that's what's holding us back from being able to get that good time and move on to the race because I would like to conquer that track uh, more than anything that way we can move on to the forest track which that's gonna be tricky we're probably gonna need to go to the Narnu for that but I'd like to get the races done here at the Oval so we've got that We've got a couple more parts. I've got to go over here and make sure they're all tuned up and fixed. We did have a little bit of cosmetic damage. Uh, it was only about 80 bucks worth, but the motor, that was $400 there worth of damage. So yeah, that's uh, kind of sorry. I kind of hit the wall, my fault, but I feel like we're going to be okay. And we're going to go right back out there and try to conquer those times. Okay, back at the race course. Hopefully this is going to work out. So we need to get that silver time, so we're going to bet on that. And let's hope we've got a little bit better, uh, hopefully got better grip this time. Uh, we'll know once we get down in the corner. Oh, yes. Yeah. That motor's working right now. I feel like those back tires are hooked up. But the question is, when we get down in the corner, what's it going to be like grip-wise? Oh, that's so much better. It's still sliding the back end a little bit, but I can keep that speed up during the corner. Oh, uh, we should be able to hit our time pretty quick this time. So here we go, fourth gear. Gonna carry that speed all the way down the back stretch here, kinda go a little bit high, and we're gonna arc down in the corner. Yes, that is that's a lot more grip than what I had. Ooh, got really close to the wall there. So let's grab a gear, try to slingshot off the corner here. Probably overdrove three and four there, but that's not bad for a first lap for starting at a kind of a stop there. So we're gonna let off a little bit, try to throw her down in the corner. I just need the silver time here, so let's grab a gear. And let's try to just hammer off this corner. Come out to the wall a bit. There's a kind of a cool little kink down this back stretch right here. Which you don't really see that many times in an oval, but it's pretty cool that it's here. So let's let off a little bit here. Try to try not to bog down the car too bad. Let's go ahead and grab our gear and try to slingshot off the corner. I feel like we're gonna do it here. I feel like we're gonna hit that time 39. Oh yeah. Got the silver time. That's good. I'm going to put around the last lap. I don't think we're... We're not good enough for the gold yet, but this should unlock the race. All right, race finished. Got that silver time. Got that $6,000. And we're ready to move on to the actual race race. And oh boy, a little, little nervous here. So we'll see what we've got. We'll see how the AI is. Do I want to risk it all? 5,000 sounds pretty good here. Let's go ahead and do it. All right. Let's hope we can get a good time in here. Uh, not bad on the takeoff. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, he was throwing it a little sideways there. Let's see if we can beat him down into one. If we can get him down into one, we're going to be okay. Okay, so we're good there. <laughs> All right, beat him down into one. Question is, what kind of speed do they carry here? You know, do we have a rear view mirror? That would actually be kind of nice, but... Ah, uh, no. Nah. Yeah, we're speeding away here. Not bad. Except for this is going to be 10 laps. Are you kidding me? I have a feeling we're going to lap them multiple times here. I, I feel like we're just killing them down the straightaways here. Let's go ahead and grab a gear. So yeah, this is going to take a while. Uh, it's kind of a little surprising that they're going to make me do 10 laps here. So I guess we're just going to try to get this done. Alright, almost at the halfway point here. We're about to put everyone a lap down. Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, are you serious? Are you serious? Oh boy. 
Oh boy. Okay, well that's gonna be a little bit of damage. Wow, that's a that's a little ridiculous. I kind of felt like I had the line there, but I don't I don't really know how smart the AI is here. But yeah, uh, let's continue on here. Uh, not too much longer to go. Uh oh, uh oh, we have trouble on the track. Oh, the AI just crashed. Oh, he's flipping. Oh no, don't hit me, don't hit me. Oh, oh, uh oh, that's not good. All right, well we got a busted windshield, but I think we're okay. Wow, that was crazy. He just kind of went down the track. I wasn't paying too much attention to that. Probably have to show a little bit of a replay. And he just shot it around. He went head on in the wall and flipped it over. That was pretty cool, actually. All right, here we are, last lap, getting by some lap traffic here. Should be good to go. I don't know how far we are out ahead of second. I know it's a long ways. I'm pretty sure we've lapped everybody at least twice. We gotta watch out for these cars here. All right, let me buy. Here we go. He's in. Grab a gear. We're gonna come off turn four here after ten laps. Not bad. Not bad. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. You stay down there. There we go. Uh, and here we come. All right, gonna finish. There we go. First place. Not bad at all. Ooh, money. Twelve thousand five hundred dollars. That's not bad at all. I feel like we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next race. The car is a little bit damaged, but I do think we're gonna be able to manage, especially if it's against the AI. Okay, here we go. We're going into the challenge here. Let's go ahead and risk another 5,000 here. Wait, what? Oh, this is a drag race? Uh-oh. Oh, I might be screwed. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh, I didn't know this was a drag race. Oh, boy. Oh, I was not paying attention there. Oh, we're catching them on the top end. Oh, that was bad. I had no clue they were going to switch from the oval to the drag race. I should have paid attention there. That's embarrassing. <laughs> wow. Well, we kind of know what we need now. We need a drag racer, which I've been kind of working on my Magura drag racer, but I think we're going to need that in order to come out here and be competitive. That's heartbreaking to lose 5,000 there, but now I know. I should have paid attention. Did it say that that was a drag race? Uh, it's a little embarrassing. Okay, so let's go ahead and take the car back to the garage. All right, my muscle car has not failed me today. It has got a big, I don't know what that is, poking out the side. Uh, it's got some damage, but it was a fighter. It did very good today. Let's go and repair it. Now, what I'm going to do, last thing, what we're going to do, is it's still in the paper. I thought about it, and it's not here anymore. Dang it, we missed it. There was a really, really cool drag racer here, and it's gone now. That's kind of heartbreaking. I kind of wanted to buy that. I was going to actually give up probably one of my Narnus to get it. But, uh, yeah, we've got a little bit of repair work to do. Let's go ahead and check the engine. Got quite a bit of money, but we're going to need a drag racer. And I don't know if I want to build one from scratch or if I want to buy a pre-built one. I'm thinking I want to buy a pre-built one, but I'm not 100% sure. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, what we're dealing with here, let's go ahead and remove this. You did good, muscle car. You did good. Uh, we've got this Magura. And yeah, 471 horsepower. Probably have to change the motor. See, there's a lot that needs to be done here to this thing. It needs drag tires, needs a change in the motor, probably a different transmission in it. I'm debating if it's worth the uh, the, the struggle, basically. Uh, one thing that I might be able to do, let's see if we can get a reset here. A lot of times when you drive out of this garage and come back in, the paper resets. Alright, so we're going to run around here for a second, and then we're going to go back into the garage and see if that paper resets. I believe that's what resets the paper, but I could be could be wrong about that, but we'll check here. All right, paper is reset, and there is a Wanger drag car. So my grandma's car, the one that I complained about, they've got a drag version of it. Now, question is, what is wrong with it? You'll be winning so many drags with this little honey. You'll start calling her the queen of the desert. Low clicks. Is it... I don't know what that means. There might be a little bit of work that needs to be done to that drag car. But we're going to have to sacrifice a car in order to get that. Hmm. Which one's going to go... Which one's gonna go? That one's worth 28,000, but that's got a... I don't know, I'm liking the black one a little bit better with the supercharger. Let's go ahead and select this. We're gonna strip this thing. We're gonna say bye to this Narnu. I don't think it's really necessary for, the, for us to have two on the lot. So everybody say goodbye to it. I'm gonna strip this real quick. Sell it, get the money, and then we're gonna go buy that drag car because I wanna complete that race. Okay, everything's sold. I did keep a couple parts off that Narnu just in case we need it. 
but we're ready to go back into the paper and we're ready to go ahead and check out this drag car real quick there we go it's gonna be in our lot and oh boy I hate the way these cars look but it is a drag racer so let's go ahead and select it you know I wonder if it's ready to run let's go ahead and look in it real quick kind of curious hopefully it's just a little bit of tuning that needs to happen let's go ahead and check its motor that's the important part that is absolutely fantastic everything's new strong motor I think we're gonna be ready to go let's go ahead and do a couple little checks here and do the oil and all that and just make sure everything's good to go all right so here we are we are ready to go here with the drag race hopefully this doesn't bite us in the rear end I don't want to bet five thousand on it let's go let's go three I just want to see if we can get this through with here we go all right, let's see what kind of pickup we can get here. Let's go and shift. There we go. And fourth. Come on, come on, pull out on him. Oh, we're gonna get him. I think we're gonna get him. Yes. Yes. Oh, we got him. Oh, that was a pretty decent. That was a pretty decent margin of victory for a drag race. But I must say, the AI is a lot more competitive at drag racing than it is normal racing. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, I'm so happy. All right, so we've got that. This track is cleared. Good to go. We need to still get that gold time and time trial, but I'm not going to worry about it quite yet. But overall, I'm fairly happy with our results here today. We've done quite a bit. Got a new drag car. Got a new tuned up muscle car with an awesome motor in there. So we're good to go there. Guys, if you have any suggestions for future Revhead episodes, let me know below. Super happy with what we're doing here today. I will go do some off-road racing next in the Force. That's the new track that just came out in the update. But anyways, folks, if you like to like and subscribe, everything helps my channel. And we will see you guys next time in Revhead. Thank you.